Hello folks, it's the Siggy. Welcome to my latest video. Okay, I'm looking at uh, customer service today and no, this isn't me trying to have a go at Gameloft at all. Um, this is just really to explain, as most of my videos are, just how to help people. Okay, we've had update 16. People have had a number of issues and the advice that they get in main, in the faction chat, on the forums is to open a ticket with Gameloft. What does opening a ticket mean? Well, allow me to show you. First, what we need to do is we need to go onto our tools and click on um, Connect. We're going to go straight down to Customer Care, the third one down. Click on Customer Care. Now, before we do anything, what we need to do is have a quick look through these known issues and the FAQs. Because what's the point in you sending an email tying customer services up if somebody else has already had the problem? Hey ho, right, I've already read through these and it doesn't address my issue. So right down the bottom, if you scroll down, it says my problem is not listed as a known issue. So we click on there. And we've got a number of mandatory fields to fill in on here. What I am going to do is I'm going to drag this away from this screen. Um, before I do that, I'm just going to put it in as a technical issue because that's my problem or my issue. Let me just drag this away to fill in my uh, private bits. Oops, I can't at the moment. Okay, this is the point where I'd say talk amongst yourselves, except that's like multitasking. I'm being expected to type and talk. So, uh, da -dum, da -da. I don't know, I could sing, but I'm a rubbish singer. I could tell you a story, but my stories aren't very good. I could tell you a joke, but that's just as bad. I think that should be enough. Okay. Uh, right, let's just drag this back and now you can see what's going on. Okay, if you can see right at the top there, it did say technical issues. That's what I clicked on on what my uh, issue was. Um, I play on Windows. Um, I use a PC. And it says where these red asterisks are that these are fields that you've got to fill in. Well, it gives me no option for mine. So, having spoken to customer service several times in the past, this information doesn't really matter. But something needs entering. So, I usually just go for one or the other on it. There we go. Now the firmware version. Again, just a made up figure. 1.2. Might not be giving me that. Oh, it tells me how to find it on Android. Uh, the store, well I actually get it from Google Play. The game is World at Arms. The version number is already filled in. And we don't have to fill these parts in. First things first. If you're contacting customer services, be pleasant about it. I mean, you're one of, I would guess, several thousand requests they get. And there's no need to be shitty with somebody who potentially could be helping you. It's not generally their fault. What I've done is just to save a little bit of time is I've um, already typed out what my uh, issue is. So I'll just paste that in there. Okay, basically, uh, I've acknowledged they've got issues with update 16. Um, and we've not, or we've lost faction glory as a, as a result of it. And I've asked them if they could compensate us. Okay, as soon as you click on send, it does not send straight away. It gives you the option of... knowledge base articles 
um, have a read through. I don't know, they don't tend to always follow on. But have a look at these, see if that answers your, your question first. If it doesn't, down to the bottom, that didn't help, or this didn't help, my problem was not listed. And we click on send. Well, the arms are truly sorry. Um, I guess they are. I guess they are, actually, because a lot of people get upset. Click on back. Uh, I can come out of... Oh, so put the X on the other side. Thank you very much. Go back on here. Uh, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my mail settings and it did say that what would happen is you would get an automated email let me just see if I can refresh that and see if we've got anything not just yet but basically in fact has it gone in my junk no let's empty that crap allow me to show you um, one that has come through before you'll get this straight away let's have a quick look where's my uh, there we go the first response no I'll get there in the end no 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 there we go this is the automated response that you get um, and everybody's will be pretty much the, the same. Opening a ticket, we now get our ticket ID. And it's, it's posted in there. If you then go into the forum and have a moan or a whinge, that's the ticket ID that you need to use. There are many people in customer services. The vast majority are really, really helpful. But again, it's not their issue. You know, it's not there, wrong to say. I know they're in a position to sort things out, but they are limited. If it's a technical issue, it's got to go to the developers. Do bear that in mind. But anyway, um, hopefully that's answered uh, a couple of questions. You've been watching the Siggy. Until next time, thank you very much.